Hey guys, welcome to AWS series. Today we'll discuss about cloud watch logs. Uh, this topic is very uh, interesting topic. Uh, why I said means uh, some real time example will take. Suppose uh, you logged into your Amazon account. Okay, so uh, like you, a uh, lot of users will use the AWS, right? AWS or Amazon, Flipkart, whatever. Whenever they're logging back and there is a logs will be generated. The how request is coming, how response is going, everything they will be stored okay this whole logs basically it will be there in ec2 instance so you need to configure this whole logs into in one place that place is cloud watch logs so by using that logs you can monitor and you can analyze also okay by using that monitoring if any suspicious ips are happening you can filter by using this ip so how, uh, how many request is happening if you feel it is like a suspicious you can you can block a particular ip okay if you are launching a website means anyone can access like 0.0.0, .0. so anyone can access that one right still if you feel anything you can use that how you need to monitor and how you need to find a metrics how you need to create alarm for these things we can do by using the cloud watch logs okay this is the overall structure so what are the steps include means i will deploy nginx server assume that is a one website so whenever you hit you it will generate some access logs and error logs both right so these logs will configure by using the cloud watch so in order to do that part you need to do some prerequisites you need to install the nginx and you need to install the cloud watch and as part of that role you need to create one role so you will learn the role also in this video okay and you need to install a aws logs if you install the aws logs you need to configure your nginx logs inside your aws okay uh, don't worry don't confuse each and every step clearly i will explain okay let me uh, start my uh, virtual machine on ec2 instance now you you good you know how to open ec2 how to create ec2 instance you know okay so what i will do i will create launch instance so here you can choose i am in the north virginia region okay so here you can open the amazon if you open amazon linux 2 yeah this is the free tier eligible like choose the select is a free tier i'm choosing the second option configure security details and if you go down here instead of installing the manually inside the box you can automate by using this script so these are the common steps you can install your nginx inside your ec2 instance okay just copy paste here okay click on add storage and if you see here this is the storage area add tax is a like optional configure security group so you can choose select existing security group so otherwise you can create the new security group with uh, add rule i will make it as uh, okay anyway ssh should run as zero either still if you need all traffic uh, you can use also but basically in the real time uh, they won't give the traffic so i am giving as anywhere all everything it will be allow click on the review here you can provide your security nginx security group i'm giving just copy paste nginx okay now click on review and launch i hope everything is good click on the launch here you can create a new existing pair either you can use right now i will take the new existing pair he will say nginx logs okay you can download a new key pair and click launch instance so it will take few time uh, few minutes to install the nginx the server should be up everything it should be done right click on the view instances so this is the server it will be installed your nginx also so by the time what we'll do this step is already ongoing is happening now you need to create a role how you need to create the role we'll see by that time click on aws here choose your iam here only you need to create uh, all roles i am in the north virginia region okay 
and click on the roles here you need to create your role click on the create role you are providing this cloudwatch role to your ec2 click on ec2 click next permission here you have a lot of policies you have what you done you can define simply logs here you will see cloudwatch logs full access click this option add a tag here you can provide the tag anything so in genx i'm using cloudwatch i'm giving next review here you need to provide your name so ec2 underscore uh, ingenx underscore cloudwatch for your information cloudwatch logs and create a role one role will be a create so you need to attach this role to your ec2 instance so where is your role this is one i need to attach okay so go for your uh, ec2 instance click on the ec2 running i hope it will be up by this time okay just uh, copy and paste it here uh, it is not at up okay we'll we'll log in and we'll see what is happen just copy and go for terminal so i downloaded a key right you need to provide a permission okay nginx logs so i given as a nginx logs sorry nginx what name i given i nginx logs okay and which permission you want to give 400 if you give okay then you can do ssh ssh hyphen i and your key name nginx ix sorry ix logs your username ec2 hyphen user and provide your ip this is your ip right just copy paste it here you can make it yes okay i you are in sudo user now okay so if you go and check these commands we executed right we'll check your uh, system ctl status nginx oh, it is running active running i hope it will be up by this time so let me copy yes your nginx is ready by this time okay so and first step is done the second step you need to attach your cloudwatch role iam role what you will do click instant here there is an option instance settings there is a attach and replace iam role you want to attach your roles where we created one role right where that what that role ec2 underscore nginx cloudwatch logs click on apply okay your role is done if you go for the ppt second step is completed now aws logs you want to install in your application okay so by what you need to do now clear my screen i have a steps also i will provide all steps inside the git repository don't worry m install okay you can say m install aws logs hyphen y if you use it will install aws logs in your ec2 instance now you need to configure okay so how you need to verify really this aws logs is installed in your system or not means there is one way you need to do is go for a uh, slash etc aws logs there is a folder will be create okay uh, let me clear my screen cd uh, let me zoom otherwise okay clear cd slash in etc folder one folder will be create aws logs if you do the ls see these all files will be created by using that plugin aws logs okay if you use uh, here we need to configure okay if you go for here this step is already done now you need to do configuration changes okay uh, up to now you guys are clear right if you open cat aws logs config see uh, if you open this uh, terminal by using cat command that nginx logs you need to configure in this uh, particular file 
how you need to configure in the next tutorial i will explain how nginx logs are displaying everything and i will explain in the next tutorial hope till this you just you practice then we'll discuss the next session in the next tutorial thank you guys